ladies and gentlemen, welcome back, and today I'm going to be doing another review. Today I'll be viewing a LEGO Dimension set. This is set 71239. This is the, I think this is the Lloyd Fun Pack, or the Golden Ninja Fun Pack, you can call it whatever you want. And it does cost $14.99 US dollars. Uh, don't know the other price things, but yeah. So, uh, it's come with Lloyd, comes with Lloyd, and his Golden Dragon. So, without further ado, let's go ahead and I'll just get my minifigure stand here and I'll show you guys the minifigure and the build. Alright, so the minifigure of Lloyd is the exact same one we got in, I believe it was 2013, in the Temple of Light and the Golden Dragon. So, I guess if you didn't get it then, this is the easiest and cheapest way to get it now because it's half the price of that uh, Golden Dragon set. So, I got both the Temple of Light and the Golden Dragon, so I have like three of these Golden Ninjas now. But, there's his face print, just in case you guys haven't seen it. And then I'll go ahead and take his head off, and take his armor off, so that way you guys can see his back print, which is really nice. And this is like, it's not chrome gold, but it's still a really nice painted uh, gold. And also, all of these LEGO Dimensions characters come with, oh shoot, wow, Lloyd just fell. So, but as I was saying, all of these LEGO Dimensions characters comes with the little stands that you can see that they're standing on. I'll go ahead and get Lloyd's in just a second, because Lloyd fell over. So, here's Lloyd's stand. He does have his, like, elemental symbol there, and then his dragon symbol there. Um, and as with all of them, you just set the figure in the middle, and he stands on it. So that's Lloyd. So now let's go ahead and take a look at the Golden Dragon. Alright, so here is like the mini Golden Dragon. I really love this build. I think they did a fantastic job just getting as much detail as they could in there. And it looks very accurate to the one that was like in the show and the one that was uh, the set. So this isn't the only form you can do. Um, I'll show you guys the other form uh, as soon as I get that. Like, as soon as we get to the box, I'll show you guys the other forms. But, um, the, 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 the add-ons, jeez, I don't know why I'm doing so bad today. The add-ons, like the cars and the mechs and the dragons and stuff, all come with these toy tags, which don't have printing on them because you can switch around the toy tags. So, for the toy tags, once you put them in the game and you write the toy tag, like you put your thing on the toy tag, you want to make sure that you keep the build on its proper toy tag. Otherwise, like, if I say, put, I don't know, put Master Wu's dragon on here, then when I place this toy tag on the stand, on the base for LEGO Dimensions, that's the dragon that's going to pop up, not the one that's on top of it. So, that's different, and that was confusing when the game came out. So, just hopefully that clarified that for you guys. And before I just tell you guys my thoughts... I'll go ahead and get the box over here and show you guys the other forms that you can put it in. You can get the Sword Projector Dragon and you can get the Mega Flight Dragon. Um, I haven't gotten either of these in the game yet because I just don't have enough studs to get that, but I did get those. So, now that I've uh, basically reviewed the set, I'll go ahead and uh, tell you guys my thoughts on this set. So guys, my thoughts on this set are actually, I like it. I think for the $14, or like 15 or I guess it's $14.99, for the money you pay for it, I think it's definitely worth it, especially if you never got the Golden Ninja, like when those sets came out. And I think the gameplay is really good, especially if you have the game. This is definitely a great addition to have um, with your game. Uh, it does unlock the Ninjago uh, hub world for you to play in, so if you don't want to get any of the any of the other ninja, you could get Lloyd, and then you can have access to this Ninjago world. So, And then I think the dragon plays really well. I haven't upgraded it yet, but I think it's really cool. So if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave it a like down below. Subscribe for more LEGO Awesomeness every week. And when you subscribe, don't forget to hit that little notification bell, so that way you'll be notified every time I upload a brand new video. And you can also follow me on Twitter for stuff that you don't get to see on YouTube. Link will be in the description. So, hope to see you guys next time. Peace! Out. Look at those two